The time is 2024 expressed in 24 hour time. This is, no surprises, a question from a 2024 math challenge paper. In fact, the Junior Maths Olympiad from 2024, they always like to get the current year in there somehow. Here we want to find the angle between the hour hand and the minute hand on an accurate analog clock at that time in degrees. So here's an accurate analog clock or a picture of one. And uh, if I just put 8.24 p.m. here, which is 20.24 onto the clock roughly, uh, we can think about what the angle between the hands would be. Between any markings on the clock between the two and the three, the three and the four and so on, uh, we would have a 360 divided by 12 or 30 degree uh, angle because there are 12 such sections uh, on the clock and all the way around the clock once would be 360 uh, degrees. So the minute markings, uh, well there's five of those between each of the hour markings, uh, so they would each be 30 divided by five or six degrees each. So if I wanted to go from here all the way over to here, well, we've got a six degree uh, angle here between the sort of 24 minutes past and the 25 minutes past. And then we sort of think of them as hours and say, okay, between five and 6 p.m., 6 and 7 p.m. and so on. There's 30 degrees here, 30 degrees here, 30 degrees here. And the awkward bit is just to work out what fraction of the way around is that hour hand between the eight and the nine. Well, it's 24 past, so there are 60 minutes in an hour, so it's 24 sixtieths of the way uh, from eight to nine. And 24 sixtieths is two fifths divided top and bottom by uh, 12. So it's exactly two of those pips along out of the five, if you like, uh, or we can say two fifths of 30 uh, is 12 degrees or just two lots of six. And so we just need to add all of those together. Now six plus 30 plus 30 plus 30 plus 12 gives us an angle of 108 degrees for the final answer.